It's time you learned, Iglesias. get money out of that, so I figure should be too bad. As far as I can see, the only person Oh dear, I shall get in trouble for this. Is everything all right? Oh, hello. Thank you for asking. I'm Cressida, by the way, and I'm afraid everything's not all right. I may be in a spot of trouble with the librarian. You see, I'm fond of creating my own charms. Thought I'd perfected my light as a feather charm to use on my library books. My arms get so tired carrying them around all day. But I must have confused the Latin word for feather with bird in my incantation, because when I opened my bag just now in the library, they literally took flight. That sounds brilliant, actually. Thank you. Somehow I don't think the librarian will see it that way. I collect the books and remove the charm myself, except this isn't the first time one of my charms has threatened the peace of the library. Our meat told Madame Scribner they were my books flying around, so she said that if I caused her any more trouble, she'd write to my parents. Uh -oh. Perhaps you could get them for me. There are only five. She won't be suspicious of a new student looking around. I suppose I could help, if I have the time. Oh, I'd very much appreciate it. One of the books is my diary. I'd rather it not fall into the wrong hands. Uh -oh. If you could collect them and bring them to me, I can remove the charm. Revelio. Can bring them. was nothing. You should see the charm I've been working on. I'm going to have to use Akio to get to those books. Akio! Got it. Only four more to go. This must be Cressida's diary. I'd want this back too if I were her. I'm reading her diary apparently. Uh, nothing juicy or embarrassing in that. Let's 
go back to the ground floor, then look around. Revelio. Rebellion. Rebellion. Action. That's the last book. Now to take them back to Cressida. Hello, Cressida. I collected your books, including your diary. Oh, what a relief. Thank you. I'll happily take the heavy lot off your hands now. Unless you want your classmates to know how you really feel about them, you might reward me for my time. Oh, you're not at all who I thought you to be. I wouldn't do that to you, Cressida. Only trying to teach you to be a little more careful. Well, lesson learned. I certainly won't be practicing any charms in the library again anytime soon. That's good. To work out where I went wrong. Perhaps I should start brushing up on my Latin. Thank goodness some people are trustworthy. Certainly wouldn't want anyone but me reading my diary. Perhaps I have to intimidate her in order to get... the money. I suppose I could sell... Because I'm probably going to need that room. Regardless. Hold me to here I come. Rebellion. Hello there. 
Ready for a little change in fashion, are we? Plenty to choose from here, so take your time. If I haven't said it before, it's a pleasure doing business with you. <laughs> I suspect you have a sharp eye for fashion. Be sure to stop by whenever you're about. Taking down that pole in the village circle. You certainly made an impression. I wonder where they go. Pardon me, but were you saying something? Oh, hello. Talking to myself. I'm Clementine Willetsy. I was musing on the precious butterflies I see near the when I was at all told horrible. It's silly, but you very well. If I have time, I shall see where they lead. Oh, how kind! Students these days have so much more courage than I ever did. You can usually find me right around here. I hope to see <laughs> you soon. Don't forget, the butterflies always seem to be on the fringes of the Forbidden Forest. That was just a bit too far. You're back. Nice to see you again. What are we looking for today? That item is of the highest quality. Item is of the highest quality. That item is of the highest quality. Thanks for stopping by. Hope to see. Whilst nearly any broom will certainly be a step up from the practice brooms in Kagawa's class, they all have their limitations. You seem to be a flyer who might be interested in, say, some enhancements? Go on. Ha! Knew I was right about you. I think you'll be quite happy with the performance of any broom at lower altitudes. But you may notice that speed consistency tends to falter as you rise. I believe I can remedy this issue. I have some ideas for enchantments, upgrades, if you will, that will improve the performance of any broom you fly. What I need is someone to conduct the broom flight and report back to me so I can perfect the upgrades. As it happens, another Hogwarts student, Imelda Reyes, is using abandoned broom courses for time trials. Clever girl. <laughs> An ideal situation for collecting flight statistics. If you were to compete for the best time and succeed, then report back to me with how your broom behaved, I could complete work on my first upgrade. What say? That sounds intriguing. I'll see what I can do. Thank you. It'll be worth your while. If I'm right, the new upgrade ought to enhance brooms in every regard. And I can give you a special price. The time trial should be a bit of fun too. Go to the Quidditch pitch and Imelda Reyes will sort you out. Once you've beaten Imelda's time, be sure to let me know. I can't help but admire Mr. Weeks' enthusiasm.
I just want to be able to fly. That's that's about it. If it isn't Slytherin's newest broom talent. Hello, Imelda. Albie Week sent me. <laughs> Did he now? Still tinkering with his broom upgrade, no doubt. I tried to help him once. He nitpicked my flying technique, and that was the end of that. The nerve. Why is he roping you into his broom testing silliness? You've barely started flying from what I know. Caught wind of you showing off in flying class with Clopton. I don't know what people have said, but I certainly wasn't showing off. Tell that's the rest of the school. But it doesn't matter. Everyone knows that class is only for beginners, troublemakers and bumbling baboons. But for some reason, now people think you're competition. Ugh, I can't be having that. Perhaps I am competition. You can't be what passes for Slytherin these days. Pfft, ragged old hats dropping at standards. Enough of this. Only one way to find out who's the better flyer. I hold one of the fastest times on this course. Let's see if you can beat it. Slytherin versus Slytherin. Actually, why not? I can beat your record. I'm so looking forward to seeing you lose. This is rather fun. <laughs> this will take some getting used to. more like it. Glad to see I'm still the reigning champion. But what say you? Want to try again? Ready when you are. Let's do this. This is rather 
fun. There we go. I've got this. Head a beater. Ah, uh, that's not. You, you must have cheated. You. Ah, uh, fine. You won. Don't think this is over. You can't determine skill from one single trial. Surely my win means something. Terrible, but you're still going to have to prove yourself if you want to earn my respect. All right, I can do it. Challenge accepted, then. Perhaps you have what it takes after all. We shall see. But don't get your hopes up. The next course near Irondale offers a much tougher challenge. You can try to prepare by racing this course again. Just check in at the podium where the leaderboard is. You can check your time and start the race. We'll see next time if your win here was more than just a fluke. Whilst on an errand for Albie Weeks. I suspect Mr. Weeks will be glad to hear how I fared. I expect this is a little bit faster than walking. I mean, I could do the shortcut of fast travel, but I kind of want to fly around a little more. You know? That's kind of silly, if you ask me. Revelio. Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? With something to report, I hope. 
Mr. Weeks, I was able to set a record on my broom. Incredible! Miss Rays must have been shocked. Tell me, how was the broom? A little turbulent, and it's wanting for a bit of speed, but it fared well enough. I will say that it tended to drift a bit to the left on certain turns. Heard a slight swoosh when I dipped. Oh, thank you. Hmm, that's precisely what I needed to know. Drifted, eh? I shall get to work immediately. Even the naysayers will be forced to admit that my work's had potential all along. I'm excited to hear more. I have a very good feeling about this upgrade. I guarantee you'll be pleased. Expect to hear from me soon. Hmm, how to address the issue of altitude? Revelio likes to speak. Talents.
Okay. Now for the difficult part. Finding that last one. There it is. Madam Kagawa, I completed the list of tasks you assigned. Wonderful. I trust you became more familiar with your broom through the process? I did. Yes, Professor. That's good to hear. Keep it up, and perhaps one day you'll have a spot on the Quidditch team. If Black ever permits Quidditch again. Well, with those tasks out of the way, let us get started. Glacius. Pay attention to your wand work. Well done. I'd recommend that you practice your new step. Before taking it out into the world. Akio. What are you doing out here? Challenging you to a game of Summoner's Court. I think it's time you faced a real opponent. Outside of Ronan's little lesson in charms class, Summoner's Court isn't just a game. It's a battle of skill. A test of a witch or wizard's metal. What say? I'm in. Let's do it. Brilliant. All right, let's... Summoner's Court. The ever-changing game. Try to beat that. Akio. Oh. I've seen worse. Akio. Come on, stop, 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 stop. That was one for the ages. Yeah. 
No crap. Missed the mark a bit on that one. Wait, did I win? I won! <laughs> we should have bet a few galleons on that round. Care to go again? I'll try one more game. I'm game for another round. Grand! You could use the practice. <laughs> Summoner's Court, the ever-changing game. Didn't think you were a match for me. Nothing to it. Akio. I want to do the city boy. <laughs> we should have bet a few galleons on that round. Care to go again? No. Another time, perhaps. Can't say I blame you. Perhaps come back when you're a bit more prepared to beat someone of my skill. All right. Well, I think. This is a fine place to stop. If you enjoyed that, go ahead and just give me a follow on here. If you're from my YouTube, I will be posting this to my YouTube. Probably break it up into a couple of segments. If you are on my YouTube, go ahead and subscribe and hit that notification bell so you're notified whenever I post. If you're not, and you're only watching me here on Twitch, I appreciate you... Um popping in on my second Twitch stream ever. And I hope everyone here has a good day.